Hello and welcome to this episode of Ask Raghav. I hope all of you are doing awesome and are very good. Today I am going to take up a very interesting question asked by Karthik and he says, Hi Raghav, just wanted to acknowledge your tremendous work which you are doing on this platform. Keep up the great work, your videos will certainly give a lot of confidence to all those who want to reach heights in their career. My question is, Assume that you are a manual test engineer and you know some automation. Is it a good decision to search for a complete automation role job or searching manual plus automation kind of job is advised? Your take on this please. So Karthik, thank you so much for your question and thank you for all the kind words you have said. Now before I start answering your exact question, I wanted to first mention that there is a lot of misconception uh, that some people believe that if I am an automation engineer, I will only be working on automation frameworks and nothing else. Now this may or may not be the case. There are organizations where there are different teams for automation testing and uh, functional testing and the automation QA team or automation testing team is only responsible for creating automation frameworks and maintaining them whereas the QA team takes care of creating the test cases, running them, finding issues, logging bugs and uh, following up with the dev team and the following up with the bugs and all those things. However, there are organizations where a automation QA team takes care of automation frameworks and maintenance along with that they also create automation tests, runs them, uh, finds the issues, logs the issues, follow up and all those kind of things. So this is what you should be knowledgeable about. Now with your experience of manual or functional I would say and then also for some automation, I will suggest that in your resume you mention all the skills you know and then apply for relevant jobs both in automation and the functional testing requirements and then from wherever you get a call you go and show up and get the interview done and then once you know what exactly is the job about whether it is completely automation or automation plus manual you can take a call based on all other factors you can take a final call in the meantime you can keep on adding more skill set both for functional and automation and this will give you much better options and opportunities i hope this will help you and if you have any other question for the next episode of ask raghav please let me know in the comment section below and i will see you next week thank you for watching and never stop learning